Hey there, and welcome back to Virtual Vanguard. Today we're unraveling the intriguing cover story of Gang Beiji's Oh My Family from One Piece. Let's dive right into it. After escaping from Tatoland, the fire tank pirates were casually sailing the sea on their stolen Tartes ship since their original ship was destroyed. Suddenly, Chiffon declared that she wants to reunite with her long-lost twin sister, Lola, and Captain Beji immediately agreed to this. They then defeat an enemy pirate crew to steal their ship and make their way to Thriller Bark, which was the last known location of Lola, only to be driven back from the Red Line due to the increased security at the Reverie. The fire tank pirates then reach Dressrosa, where Beji decides to pick up supplies from. Upon landing at Dressrosa's west port, they defeat two marine soldiers and encounter a guitarist who mistakes Chiffon for Lola and congratulates her for finally finding a husband. After learning they are actually sisters, the guitarist informs the crew that Lola had arrived at Dressrosa just some days before, much to their total shock and convenience. The crew enter the city which still exhibits the remains of the destruction caused during the events of the Dressrosa arc including the ground scarred by Doflamingo's birdcage. Disguised, they started looking and asking for Lola among the citizens, with Beiji finding two women whose backsides are similar to Chiffon and Lola's. Suddenly, Vito finds several men collapse to the ground with kiss marks on them due to a vacuum kissing spree by Kuen. The reason for this is because the germ pirates, who chose to attack Dressrosa while King Riku was away, were causing chaos by spreading their kiss-kiss germ among the citizens. Fortunately, Beji and Vito defeat them easily, but only to keep them from attracting unwanted attention from the marines. At the same time, however, Chiffon was just about to get a haircut at a barber shop when she is suddenly caught and arrested by a high-ranking marine for her connection to Beji. As she screams, Gotti notices this and chases after her, but the Marine defeats him easily. Beji and Vito were unable to help as they were under attack by citizens who were infected by the Kiss Kiss germ. Gotti gets back up and goes after the Marines once again. After causing an explosion with his weapon arm to distract the Marines, Gotti manages to rescue Chiffon. She thanks Gotti with a kiss while addressing him as a stranger, which confuses him. Suddenly, the real Chiffon appears along with the rest of the fire tank crew, and the woman Gotti rescued is revealed to be Lola, and the twins tearfully embrace each other. The Risky brothers also appear and thank the fire tank pirates for rescuing their captain. Meanwhile, the Tontata pirates were sailing back from the reverie when they find a Tartes ship with the injured pound on it near the coast of Green Bit. Back at Dressrosa, Lola asks Gotti to marry her as thanks for saving her. Before Gotti could answer, however, the Marines suddenly attack, forcing both the fire tank and rolling pirates to make a hasty getaway from the country. Both crews arrive at the Dressrosa port and find the Tontata pirates along with a patched-up pound, who Chiffon recognizes as the old man they saw when they escaped from Cacao Island. Pound in turn was brought to tears upon seeing both of his daughters and revealed himself to be their father, shocking the sisters. However, they refuse to believe him and make their escape from the island while leaving behind Pound for the incoming marines. Determined to be with his daughters, Pound swims after the fire tank pirate's ship amidst the cannon fire, which surprises the sisters but elates Pez. As Pound gets close to the ship, he shows the crew a picture of the moment when Linlin -Lin literally kicks him out of the family, with their newborn daughters in the background as proof of his claims. Upon seeing the photo, as well as his stubbornness, the sisters finally believe him after they recall their mother telling them that their father was a clingy person who never gives up no matter how many times he's kicked. They and their crews help their father onto the ship with ropes and then a tearful pound happily embraces both of his daughters after 26 long years. Later on it is revealed that Godi accepted Lola's marriage proposal and both the fire tank pirates and rolling pirates celebrate at their wedding. As they happily celebrate, the fire tank pirate's ship sails away as a marine ship pursues them with cannons firing, which Beji considers to be part of the celebration. Thanks for tuning in. If you enjoyed the video, drop a like, comment your thoughts, and don't forget to subscribe for more exciting anime explorations. Until next time, keep the anime passion burning. See you in the next one.